Okay, dosing testosterone for women. So topical two to 10 milligrams daily, inner thigh, if the women aren't comfortable using it vaginally, but I'm big believer for the reasons I said before um, to use it vaginally. Sublingual, same thing, because um, you're bypassing first pass. So it's still two to 10 milligrams um, a day, short half-life injections, five to 10 milligrams twice weekly. I mentioned the peaks and valleys. Pellets, uh, 50 to 150 milligrams every five to 12 weeks. Now the problem with pellets is you don't know, especially when you put it in the first time, you don't know what dose you're going to need. So you check them like, you know, four weeks later. Um, and if it's too little, you have to give them a cream to supplement anyway. And if it's too much, they have oily, neck, they have oily skin and acne for, you know, eight to 12 more weeks. So that's another reason why I don't like pellets is because you can't titrate the dose. Um, and there is no FDA approved product of testosterone for women. I was just working with a woman now that just texted me what a doctor prescribed for her and a doctor prescribed um, androgel for her, which is the male dose of testosterone and it wants her to use a little bit of that. Well, the problem with that a little bit, how much is a little bit? It's made for a man. It's a concentration made for a man. So it's really easy for the woman to overdose. So at a combine pharmacy, we make a specific dose for a woman. 